Hey guys we've just got a really quick tesco haul for you guys now and it's very late on the night so you could hear um the kids in the background so i've just done a voiceover so i'm just going to jump straight into it for you guys so we've got two um strawberries some plums grapes peppers some curly kale um i've got a cucumber and some spring onions this is just a top-up shop um until we do our big shop next week um, we've got some garlic, a mango, some iceberg lettuce and some kiwis, some potatoes 
and some broccoli also i always get the frozen broccoli i think we've got three or four um bananas and a big bag of rice i think it's four kilograms and it's like four pound and it lasts us three or four weeks um so it does la it is worth it definitely um and the pasta is the same yeah and then we've got the potato waffles they're great for like quick snacks if the kids are like having like a hunger pang or something they just shove them in the toaster and they're brilliant um and we've got one of these simply cook um boxes they just come with three little pots and a recipe like to follow on the back and they're really good i had a box of these before you get little recipe cards that come with them and you can keep them like i've still got them in my cupboard now um i'll probably show you guys in my next video when i do some more cupboard organization um if you guys want to watch that but yeah this is what they're doing in the tesco ones so they tell you the steps. I mean, these are really good for like beginners as well. If you're not used to cooking, I do love cooking and I love cooking from scratch. So I know what goes into my food, but these are so, so good. Um, and you can substitute some of the ingredients in there. Like we're not having chicken or chorizo. So what I did was, um, I think I bought, yeah, I bought these chorizo sausages um, and I chopped those up, fried them and put those in instead. And we put chickpeas in as well and it worked. Um, the boys absolutely loved it. But you could put prawns in, you could put chicken in, you could you could put anything in really. Um, you know, and you can just substitute it and add things. And yeah, it was just a really nice family meal. It was a little bit spicy, the kids said. Um, and I definitely didn't give it to Hope because I knew it was going to be a bit hot for her. But yeah, they're really good. I think they're about £2, but I'll put it on the screen for you guys. Um, but they're worth it. We've had a box from Simply Cook before. I think I've said that already. We've got some icing because it was Riley's birthday. And I was going to do him a cake with the icing. But we ended up just doing like um, a big Oreo one. I'll put a picture up of it. Um, a drip cake. So I didn't use that to do the figure. Okay, so we've got some tuna, some peanut butter. Smooth peanut butter two um pots of cream then we've got some mayo this one wasn't actually that nice if i'm totally honest some chickpeas two plum tomatoes some beans some red thai curry paste that one's fine um i used to have the red is it red dragon or blue dragon i'm not sure <laughs> um some lemon squash and tea bags these tea bags are really nice and um, we've already had them now um we've got some wraps for wrap wednesday and those are the chorizo style bangers um they're like sausages they were hard to cut up but they were really nice once i'd fried them and added a bit of seasoning so yeah and we've got some tortelloni um this is the spinach and ricotta one and what we do with that is we cook it with cream and cheese and butter and garlic and kale and it's might sound a bit weird but it's a really nice dish it's going to be in my next video so yeah cheese we've got yogurts Oh, the method cleaner. I love this smell in the, I think it's a wild rhubarb. Absolutely love it. Um, it just reminds me of um, when Hope was little, when she was first born, because it was the first time that I tried that scent. So I do always buy that one if it's on offer and they were on offer. I think they were £3 each, um, but we're all out of sprays. So I could justify myself. Um, yeah, I could justify just buying them. And I only use bleach in the toilets. So I've got two bleach and I'm just telling you guys that I only use them in the toilet. Um, and then we've got some wipes because things are opening up. But yeah, we just, we bought those so we could go out because I like to wipe the slide and swings if we are going on the park because I am over the top. I'm going to own it. Um, or maybe I'm just careful. I don't know. Yeah, we've got some dishmatic refills because we're out. We've got these pull-up pants. Um, they're just good for in the day because I don't know if you have a toddler, but they don't want to lie down and have their bum changed. So sometimes it's easier to just, and just pull them up and she can run off and play. <laughs> um, yeah, but we are going to try and switch to cloth nappies soon because she's will be potty training soon and I don't want to keep buying nappies. And then I've got these ones for the night time because they're just more absorbent. Um, I did get the Child's Farm shampoo and conditioner. This one smells so good. And um, I think we got a club card offer and it was, they were £3 each. They're normally like £4 or £5, um, but they were £3 each. 
and they last so long um, because I don't use a lot on her anyway um, at a time like just a tiny little bit and it smells so so good so that is all the haul it's like I say it's just a little top-up shop and um, we just needed some fresh stuff and I like to get the bulk stuff like the rice the nappies and the wipes but yeah there's our little top-up shop so thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time yeah.